things are happening at, at Portland State. It started off with a few contracts, a few grants. The number of experiments and things has continued to build and support both our, our research, our fundamental research, but as well as the flight experiments that we currently have on the space station. One of the experiments is uh, uh, this automated experiment, and that can be operated once the astronaut installs it 24-7. And then we're under pressure. The, the uh, graphical user interface that we use is a bunch of clicking and, and moving numbers, but we're controlling pumps, pistons, valves, cameras, and we're so delighted the way the experiment turned out, we can actually operate it indefinitely. On this project, I was one of the uh, operators. I would control the experiment from uh, on the ground here, send up commands to uh, the space station, and the experiment would essentially do, do what I told it. It's kind of remarkable, actually, that we're able to just send up commands to the space station, control what's going on up there. Well, I find that pretty amazing. When I contemplate what we're accomplishing here at PSU, I can't, I have a hard time grasping it myself, even though I have the experience. I can't take this stuff for granted, it's too neat. We're taking data, the Earth is spinning below us, we're getting streaming video of astronauts on spacewalks, we're seeing the sunrise and sunset every hour and a half, it's just a delight. Now if I was a student, it being part of that, it just is an exposure to a whole line of work. The things that NASA does are very exciting. To be part of that is just a, just a delight. The students are getting experience meeting these folks, training astronauts to do the experiments, working on the details of their experiment, and then publishing the results in the highest journal. We really think we're going to make a, a splash with this. It's a really an experience, so we're pretty lucky to uh, have that experience here at PSU.